Welcome to this edition of Investment Insights Plus. Today, James and I will touch on topics currently trending in the markets. There have been talks of disinflation globally. What is disinflation and how is it different from deflation? It's a good question and very topical. Disinflation is a decrease in the rate of inflation. In other words, it means that prices are still rising but at a slower rate. And it is quite different from deflation, which is a negative inflation rate whereby prices are decreasing. How will disinflation impact the markets? It is clear that interest rate hikes by central banks are having their intended effect, with slowing economic growth leading to headline inflation falling in most advanced economies, although remaining a lot stickier and higher than we would have liked. Now inflation isn't bad for markets per se, so we need to understand where we are coming from today, which is historically very high inflation, combated by central banks around the world raising interest rates at the fastest pace since the 1990s. Now disinflation in this regard we believe would be welcomed by the markets as it can reduce some of these cost pressures for both businesses and households and perhaps indirectly signalling a ceasefire in interest rate rises, perhaps even a decrease, which again would be positive for markets. Thanks James. There has been a lot of talk recently about how tech stocks are driving overall market performance. How so? The Super 7, as they are collectively known, heavily out of favour over 2022 and really the only thing in favour over 2023 thus far. So the NASDAQ index, which is technology heavy, has had its best start to a year in four decades. So it is true, the impact of these companies such as Nvidia up 190% this year alone, alongside the likes of Microsoft, Apple and Meta have completely driven market performance within the global equity space this year. These are also the biggest companies, collectively having driven around 90% of the total market return this year at a point in time, which is just enormous, and also disguises the fact that hundreds of other companies out there are going through a tough time. There's no denying artificial intelligence or AI is a huge market opportunity. I've heard quotes of the new electricity before. We've probably all heard of ChatGPT. So there's absolutely no surprises that these larger companies are completely gunning for market share in this space. The winners have a lot to gain. Thank you for watching this edition of Investment Insights Plus.